Hi Pisces, this is Jackie Tomlin. This is your general reading for the week of December 12th, 2022. Thank you guys for stopping by. Please remember these are just general readings, so take with you what resonates, leave what does not behind for someone else. If you're seeking a personal reading, it is JackieTomlin.com. Pisces, you can expect to reconnect or reunite with someone from your past, and if you immediately thought, I don't want to reconnect with the, that person, it's not that person. Okay? Uh, there is a celebration or a joyful outing, that's what I'm seeing. You're putting a stop to being used or taken advantage of by someone. You're working on your self-esteem issues. You're under new opportunities and good luck and abundance. There will be more than one small wish granted. And we have two signs that may or may not resonate with you, which is going to be an Aquarius as well as a Taurus. All right, Pisces, let's see what we have going on for you. First card up, we have the Queen of Wands. This says you're grounded, you're centered, you're putting your foot down, and you're being true to yourself, okay? With that, we have the Three of Pentacles. You are working on growing your money. It's, it's a plan coming together because Father Time is involved here. So it says it's not this week. But maybe you're putting together a budget or some kind of plan to expand your business or expand what you're doing here. We also have the Magician. This trumps your entire reading. Your yes answer. This is the highest card in the deck. This says you get everything you want and desire is right there on the table before you. We have Temperance. Temperance says change the way you're doing things because when you embrace that when you do the same things, you get the same result and change it up, that leads you to success. Also, a Sagittarius may or may not resonate center of the reading is the five of wands okay that's coming in with being true to yourself stop trying to please everyone particularly family friends people on the home front okay and we have the ace of swords when i say reconnection with someone from the past this is communication with that person um and like I said, this is um, a, a great reconnection with somebody that you're really thrilled to reconnect with. We also have the Seven of Pentacles. And the Seven of Pentacles is working and gaining, uh, planting the seed, watching it grow. Some of you are doing raises and or promotions, bonus checks, commission checks, something to that effect. And we have the Ten of Cups. Okay, so... Pretty important stuff here. If you are single, you are actually headed to a relationship. If you are in a relationship, it is time to level up. You're ascending to living together, engagements, things like that. But you're headed to another level. And we have the devil card coming in with intensity and the love life. Okay. And honestly, for some of you that have nothing going on, it could be a reconnection with someone from your past. So. Let's continue on with these messages from my Pisces. This is your week of December 12th, 2022. We have the Queen of Swords. The Queen of Swords is a Virgo energy. Uh, this is someone that's coming in with some um, unexpected advice, but much needed advice. And then we have the Page of Cups, an unexpected offer of love. You could be dealing with another Pisces, okay? With that magician, we have the Queen of Pentacles, financial independence. Again, this is the second time Aquarius has come into play in your reading. On the Temperance card, we have the Eight of Swords. This could be a busy week, but you also have this Eight of Swords here. This is the card of self-imposed restrictions, and it says that, you know, you're not going to move forward. No one's going to hold you back but you, okay? On the Five of Wands is the Nine of Swords. Don't overthink things because it will cause a loss of sleep. So disruption in the sleep pattern is what I'm seeing. And we have the Seven of Swords. When you reconnect with this person, uh, I will say this, that they're not going to tell you everything. I don't say that they're lying to you because this is normally the card of lies and deception. I don't think they're lying to you, but I don't think they're telling you everything. On the Seven of Pentacles, there is a good business deal coming up here, okay? Uh, if you're seeking a job in general, this is a good way to find a job, change jobs, side hustle, anything like that. And we have the Messenger card, okay? This is the second time a Sagittarius energy has appeared here as well. The message is, there's date night coming up. Okay, for some of you, and believe me, I've seen this for a lot of the singles, be warned of a one-night stand. So, I put it out there so you know. 
And the center of the reading bonus, we have the King of Pentacles, financial independence and a Gemini. So what we have, Pisces here, you guys, we have, there is definitely a power couple going on here. Success and money. Okay. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget JackieTomlin.com for personal readings. You have a fantastic week and I'll see you soon. Bye.